Hey there, struggling to get your Google Nest Mini or Home Mini to connect to Wi-Fi? I get it, it can be super frustrating, but don't worry. In this video, I'll walk you through some simple step-by-step -step solutions to get your device back online. Let's dive right in. First up, let's talk about Wi-Fi signal strength. If your Nest Mini is too far from your router, it might be getting a weak or spotty signal. This is especially true if there are walls, furniture, or even appliances in the way. Move your Mini closer to the router. Try to avoid placing it near walls, microwaves, or other electronics that might interfere with the signal. A clear line of sight to the router is ideal. Next, let's check if your network is overloaded. If too many devices are connected to your Wi-Fi, it can slow things down or even kick devices off. Take a quick inventory of what's connected. Smart TVs, phones, tablets, etc. Disconnect anything you're not actively using and see if that helps. Sometimes the problem isn't with your Mini. It's your router. Temporary glitches or outdated settings can mess things up. Restart your router by unplugging it, waiting 30 seconds, and plugging it back in. While you're at it, check if your router's firmware needs an update. And here's a pro tip. Switch your network to 2.4 GHE if you can. It works better for devices like the Mini. Lastly, software updates. Just like our phones, these devices need updates to fix bugs and stay compatible with new features. Open the Google Home app, head to your device's settings, and check for updates. It only takes a minute. If all else fails, a factory reset might do the trick. But here's the thing. Resetting the Home Mini first and second generation and the Nest Mini second and third generation is a little different. Let me break it down for you. For Google Home Mini, first generation, keep it plugged in, no battery here so it needs power. Flip it over and find the small circular reset button on the bottom. Press and hold that button until you You're hear- You're about to completely reset Google Home. To cancel, release the button. Don't release it. Keep holding until the device powers off and back on. When it restarts, it'll say- To get started, download the Google Home app. For Google Nest Mini, second generation. Unplug it and wait for about 20 seconds. Turn off the microphone switch on the side. You'll see a red indicator. Plug it back in. Now place your finger on the center of the mini and hold for 10 seconds. It'll say, You're about to completely reset this device. Release to cancel. Don't let go. Wait until the reset process kicks in. Once it's reset, open the Google Home app and set it up again. Super simple. And that's it. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tips and tricks.